A very good morning and we are back in the Nightingale Shogari Park which is just two minutes away from my home and we are here with the beautiful lilies behind us and we're going to talk about the beautiful Vardans which make us like a beautiful flower in our life. Flower means thinking like a flower, beautiful. Having an intellect like a flower, beautiful. So let's see what does Baba have to say in today's blessing. Baba says, may you have elevated fortune and constantly eat and serve others with the nourishment of happiness. First, eat nourishment. It's not about physical eating. It's about the soul which is eating the thoughts, the knowledge of nourishment for happiness. Nourishment of happiness of Brahman life. Let's go into the explanation. We are the children and the masters of the master of the world. Supreme God, Father or God or Allah is the master of the three worlds. Not just one world, but three worlds. So God says that we have the elevated fortune that once we consider ourselves to be masters or children of the Supreme Creator or the creation of Supreme Creator, then we become masters. Constantly have this godly intoxication and happiness. That we are the children of the master of the world. It's a, such a big thing. Somebody who is a child of a minister thinks of himself non, nothing less than anything anybody else. Similarly over here. We are the children of the master creator of this world. What title would that be? Think about it and remain in happiness. Wa my elevated fortune. This is my destiny. Beautiful destiny. Constantly continue to swing in this swing of happiness. I am constantly fortunate for I am constantly eating and serving others with the nourishment of happiness and when you think that I am the child of God I am the child of the master of the world and I am the one who has got an elevated fortune I'm so fortunate to have received God's knowledge who God is where does he live what does he look like what does he do what is my relationship with him when you get to know all these things it's waha my fortune waha and the nourishment of happiness increases so God says, you give others the great donation of happiness and make them fortunate. Happiness is your life. To remain happy is to live and to not remain happy is to be living physically but dead spiritually. This is the elevated blessing of Brahmin life. So life over here means living spiritually. The mind can be thinking pure, powerful, elevated thoughts or the mind can be thinking dull thoughts but you have everything around you physically for comforts but your mind is thinking dull thoughts that's not living that's like living physically but dead spiritually how do you increase this fortune how do you get to know that who is that master of the world and what is our relationship with him that our fortune becomes elevated is what we learn in Brahma Kumaris in details in the seven day course do come over and learn that it's for your own benefit and the benefit of the near and dear ones of your house. With this, Om Shanti.